and welcome back to Andres Arre, where today we'll be watching Raised by Wolves, Season 1, Episode 8, titled Mass. So, we are getting very close to the ending of this season. For me, so far, just doing my rating of this uh, season, it is mediocre for me. Sometimes we get a hit, sometimes we get a miss. And I feel like a lot of the storylines are dragged on after episode after episode. If I see Tally one more time and not understand what she's talking about, I literally might smash my head against the window. Like this Tally story, like I'm over it. I don't, like I actually don't even care anymore. Like, did she die in the hole? Did she not die in the hole? Is this a ghost? Is it not a ghost? Like, I don't even care. Um, so, but that storyline is, we're still now going at episode eight and we still don't understand what's going on. Um, Campion is an annoying character. I, I, I kind of get what they were doing with Campion, but like, I'm over it. So there's a lot of I'm over it in this season. Um, Campion like doesn't listen. He doesn't follow rules, which is fine. We always have to have some type of character like that. But it's just like every single thing he does, it just seems to get worse and worse. Like this, um, this group of god worshippers or whatever they are, they pretty much are trying to convert Campion into one of them in the last episode. But Campion, he didn't want to do it. Instead of, well, he was going to do it. And then he saw the headstones of his sisters and brothers, which is understandable why he flipped out. But instead of using the knife or whatever it was um, to stab one of the humans, maybe the woman who was standing right next to him who just did not care about it with the tombstones, he decides to st stab the android. An android who clearly cannot feel it. And you stabbed him in his arm. So, I mean, that was annoying. Um, Mother escaped. I, the best character in this show is Mother. First, it used to be Paul. Paul doesn't bother me that much. Um, but Mother. Mother is a really good character. They, um, Marcus was going to go kill her because she found out that he, or she kind of just knew that he was an atheist and knew that he was not who he's claiming to be. So they went into the woods to go kill it. But then Marcus had a fight with himself, his atheist self. And they had a battle and then Marcus got stabbed by the other Marcus. Then father, who got reprogrammed, ended up saving mother by holding, when he threw her down the whole thing, he ended up holding on to, um, I don't want to call it a yarn or a string, a rope. There we go. And she managed to escape, thanked him and told him she'll be back for him and the kids. Now, she doesn't have her eyeballs, so I don't know what she's going to do. Is she going to make some new eyeballs and destroy people? Is she going to... I don't know. Now, Paul and the mother, the her name is Sue, they've been having issues with Marcus because he's starting to go crazy. He's hearing voices. So I'm thinking in this episode that they're going to... It's either this episode or episode 9. They're going to turn on him. And then maybe episode 10, he's going to be like the ultimate baddie and go against mother. And once again, I don't even care if Tally is... I know Tally is going to be in here. I know we're going to hear these voices. And I know at the end of this episode, I'm not going to know anything. I'm prob You know what? They're going to probably drag this on to season two. That That's how much dragging this is. I like things to be just wrapped up quickly. Like this recap. So let's just jump into this episode and find out what Raising Wolves has got to give. Bloop! Marcus, you're still alive. Of course. <laughs> He's gonna cut off his face. Oh, I knew he was gonna do it. Oh, I was about to say. He looked like Red Skull. Marvel. Here we go with these pictures again. Oh, look, the mouse. I bet she's gonna kill it. He'll probably eat it. This show is so fucked up. <laughs> you know, it's a soul. We're just like mouse. If he sees us doing something naughty. Don't be fragile. So it's not gonna take it easy on you. So neither can I. I thought he was gonna kill that mouse. Shut up. Shut oh up, God, I said. here comes Tally. 
What's he doing? He's gonna try to. Extremely disappointed. You don't recognize me. Yes. I cannot control their operation. Diagnostics all look good. Maybe it's a weird glitch in your tech. It is. It's Morse code. You are old. Saul is the light. He's probably doing that on purpose to confuse you because father is smart and I love father. Is this the broken ship that we keep coming back to? No, she sounds like a dog. That's crazy, raised by wolves. That's so interesting. I'm a doctor, not a blood bag. Today you're both. You're an A-class life technician, correct? Yes. What do you advise? To get out your that chain. Your bleeding internally, draining into your stomach. You need to release the pressure. Do I have to be a tough survivor? You already are. Do you like it here? It's okay, I guess. So we don't have huh. to treat him like the way we treated atheists on Earth. No, we don't. Is Dad gonna come on the adventure? Do you want him to? He's got a lot in his mind. Just keep it between me and you. Uh-oh. I've lost pairing with my brothers. Do you know where they are? Broken. Ah. Uh. I'm feeling something that is not in my anatomical built description. What is it? I don't know, Carl. You're the doctor. 3.4 inches of diameter. Hmm. Probably a silicon tube. Pull it out with a counterclockwise motion. Your senses may be misfiring. My caregiving program, it's overriding me. That's odd. Your survival is essential to your caregiving duties. Are you sure? The only way to alleviate the discomfort is to feed the tumor field blood. Then it will cease to feed on you. But don't look at me. You'll need to find more donors. This thing, this boy is still trying to Got dig a hole. This for you. Pull it up. Thanks. So we must focus on serving him, right? Yes, we should. So that means we must stay pure. That means you must stay away from that atheist kid, okay? He's actually really like turning into one of them. I wasn't a date, I was being tortured. You needed rescuing. No, I didn't. I was, I was in the process of escaping. And I rescued you. Can the boy hear them talk? Crazy soul, soul flight. If you are not the destination passenger on the armed terrorist, please. Each other's back. You and me. It's a whole night. Girl, about this one off. Let's talk about this inside. You and me. She always stayed to the atheist way. Huh. Put a little surprise in there for you. What you doing, buddy? Nothing. Uh-oh. Told you you get caught. Cause it kind of looks like you're hiding something from your daddy. No. Are you and mommy planning something? You can tell me it's okay. Mm. You would never lie to me, would you? Get the hell away from him! Mom, Paul, we're leaving. It's okay. Get back here! Oh, okay. No! Oh, no! Let go of him! No! No! I told you we're not going anywhere! Forgive my wife's soul! We must pray that she returns to soul's light! Oh god, this girl with her mullet, she irritates me. Tempest was right to run away from here. They didn't even notice Tempest was gone. Why did the android cross the road? I can barely hear you. I hope there's more to your plan than just... just... let me finish, please. You're gonna dig your way out. But with someone else's hands. I allowed myself to be invaded. Neglected my mission. My family. Campion is now suffering because of my action. Humans often complain of suffering. 
but they also heralded. Yes. Despite being raised pacifist. That was like a kind of like a pointless part of this whole story. I'm here. Look how quickly he's doing that. Yes, okay, I'll see you soon. I'm sorry about what happened. Do no, you he's not. Me? He is called right. No. I was really scared that your mommy and you wouldn't leave me. But now I know you would never do that. So he's using the Android's hands? Never put your trust in Campion. He's gonna mess up. Please, so show me that I am on a righteous path. I need you to show me. Tell me what I should do. Oh, and he thinks that's Saul? This guy, this episode. I'll take my mom and kiss you to the winter. Please don't tell anyone. I won't. As long as you take us with you. Yes! They're coming with us. Come on. They are? Yeah. That's what she just said. Let's go. Okay. Real understanding of the underlying concepts. The, 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 the. Technology that powers you was a gift from soul. And she smells like a wolf. You tr trust me, you don't need that to take out Campion. You could just breathe on him. I'm sorry. Are you? Imagine if he just picks that up and s cuts him in half. It started itching as soon as I tasted the plasma. You think the Chris has carbon-based components? Perhaps when the plasma circulates through my system. Well, that intro is done. What am I doing? That was some cool body movement though. She could be a dancer. Meet us in the letter. So Campion drop it on purpose. Are they still at that camp? Ciao. Drag out the suspense. They take suspense to a whole new level. Oh! Tempest. Mother. Tempest! I forgot about you again. <laughs> so forgettable. You're bleeding. Before you lecture me about being careful. Girl. Ah! Now she's a vampire. Great. How did he get... How did he get there? This way. Hey, move. Go. Well, she's not an android. She is a vampire. Child will always be a part of you. Child will never reject you. No. Never tell you that you're not real. No. What you're carrying inside you is the mission. No. It's always been the mission. No, no. No, I don't want it. I don't want it. Yeah. Who's the father? Thus, we're gonna lay off her standing there, pregnant. 
Okay. Um. So let me be nice. I have to be nice. So this episode was good. This this show doesn't make any sense to me. Even when I try to figure it out, I just can't figure it out. But you know what? This show is like a number one show. A lot of been a lot of people have been excited. I believe it got um, renewed for season two. But there's just so many things. I think there's just too, like I just I just want one storyline that has been since episode one to be fulfilled and finished before we jump into another one. I'm very, I'm a basic kind of person. Just keep it simple. Um, if I ever wrote movies or film, any type of art, I would just be so simple. Now, I know it's not easy, but this is really complex. Now, I believe this is from a book. Um, I don't want to be a liar, but I think it's from like a book or something that's raised by wolves. And that's what they add uh, to the adaptation for like now this TV show. But if the books, if it is a book or something, it must be really complicated to understand. Like you would be, or, or maybe it makes more sense in the book than it does when you see it. For for some viewers, when we see it on film, you're like, child, like, oh my God. So Campion can't do anything right. Like how did Campion not realize that the thing in his ear is gone? Like. There's something in, jammed in your ear. You didn't notice that one of them is gone. I guess maybe because he was running. Who knows? Father is like playing with like, I'm father. I'm not father. I'm father. I'm not father. Mother is a vampire. Now she's pregnant. Now she's a pregnant vampire. When she smells blood, like she goes crazy. Or maybe a wolf. Maybe she's a she's legit a wolf. You had for literally half this episode on Saul standing by that burning hut, like praying or just doing whatever they're doing. Then one of the soul people was somehow in the woods and got far farther than the group of people that have been running in the woods. So there is that. And now, yeah, mother, I guess she's gonna have an Android baby. I don't know, y'all. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how I feel. It was better than the last one, but I am still really... I think my liking of this show has just... It's plummeting. But you know what? Can I get people who watch this show, can you comment down below? Like, do you guys... Obviously, you'll like the show if I'm asking you to comment down below. But just let me know your information about this show. Is it a, is it a book... Is it keeping clear to how the books are? Are you guys enjoying it? Like, are you excited for season two? I mean, I have two more episodes. Maybe maybe I'll change my mind. Because in the beginning of this season, I was really, I really liked it. And I wanted to see this from all the trailers. But I don't know what's happening with me. Maybe my interest is just leaving. Like, like, like this tally story should have been left. Oh, and another episode with... No information about Tally or these drawings. Like, not even a glimpse of hint. Like, I don't understand. Like, she came and she was talking and I don't understand. Then she disappeared again. Guys, I'm over it. Okay, well, that was my reaction to Raised by Wills, episode eight. If you are not subscribed, hit that subscribe button. It's either here, 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 or over here. And please like and share my videos. And I'll see you all next time on Andres Rey.